Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. So guys, today I create really cool and new style of soft body animation in Cinema 4D. So firstly guys, I create some composition. So I take this time plane and I increase plane size. I increase like 4000, simple. And second shape, guys, I take cylinder. Yes, and guys, I go to display cellar god shading lines here. Guys, I increase size, so radius, this one, increase like 260, 260, and decrease height. Height, I take simple like 30, yes, right, okay, so guys, now I increase segments, segments increase like this, okay, so guys, see, that's my simple base, and now I create glass shape, so I take tube this one and same guys inner size increase increase inner size and also outer radius increase outer radius i take like 240 and inner radius increase i take like guys take 235 centimeter this one and guys same i increase height segments is good rotation segments increase yeah and height guys increase like this and decrease i take like height guys 300 is good and up yeah see guys that's my simple like bowl right okay so guys all is good now and guys select this tube and x-ray so go to basic and you can take x-ray click here otherwise second option is uncheck x-ray right click on tube and take display tag this one and use this one and take line right see guys, see guys that's my second option okay so guys now I take spare spare and up guys spare radius decrease and radius i take like 40 simple and decrease segments segments guys this time i take simple 12 yeah that's my low poly spare right okay so guys now i take cloner and select this spare and make child with cloner yes and guys select this cloner and mode i take grid array yes and guys up up and increase size increase i take like 250 and same 250 and 250 yes right okay so guys select this cloner and i go to chord and up up more i take like 700 yes great and play okay so guys now i apply tags so i increase frame frame i take like 600 and create full frame so select this plane and right click on plane guys apply collider body tag yes and shape i take static mesh same guys select this tag apply on cylinder and same apply on tube yes and guys now apply soft body tag on cloner so select this cloner and right click and take soft body this time soft body and guys inheritance tag apply tag to children and individually element use all that's it okay so guys also that's my shape and take this time moving mesh that's my moving object so play yes see guys right that's my really purple effect okay so guys now also apply wind so go to simulate and 
this time I take wind yes and rotate guys rotate wind 90 degree like this okay so guys after I change some setting on wind so I create ball animation this one see guys now jumping is good now I create keyframe animation like ball animation so guys go on here and that's my soft body tag and guys I go to here soft body so change some settings guys flexion I take like 100 so play yes better okay so guys now flexion same 50 is good go to back and play okay so guys all is good now so guys now you can hide this wind hide now so play yeah great okay so guys i create animation so use rest length and pressure and guys go to zero frame rest length check and pressure check guys i go to like 50 frame 50 and same rest length check and pressure check guys i go to 60 frame 60 rest length i take like one to five and check and pressure i take like 20 and check yes and guys i go to like 90 frame 90 and rest length check and press this animation key guys i go to 100 frame 100 and so rest length i take 150 percent and press this animation key and pressure i take like 40 and check yes right guys i go to now 140 frame and press this animation key rest length and pressure guys go to 150 and increase size 175 and press this animation key and pressure i take 60 and check and guys now i go to 190 frame 190 and 190 check and check guys go to 200 frames and rest length i take like 200 and check pressure i take 80 and check yes guys go to 240 frame and check and check guys last one i go to 250 frame so rest length i take 2 to 5 percent check and pressure i take 100 yes See guys, that's my simple keyframe animation. That's my all keyframe, right? Okay, so guys, go to back and play. Yes. See guys, right? It's really good. It's really like bouncy animation. Yes, great. See guys that's my really bouncing animation soft body animation and last one more pressure okay so guys i stop this animation stop guys go to wind and win uncheck so guys object wind speed i take zero on zero frame so select this wind and wind check Guys, I go to like 200 frames, 200 and wind speed, I take like 10 and check. Guys, I go to last 600 frame and wind speed, I take 50 and check. So, go to back and play. Yes, better. Right? See guys that's really good
Yeah, that's really good. Right guys, that's my final animation. It's finished now. I apply material. Go to load material. Guys, I already create material. I have materials. That's my material file. That's it. So apply on white material. Guys, create also background. So select this plane and copy and rotate. 90 degree, go to back like this. Guys, apply gold material on spare. And that's my glass material on tube. And guys, that's my silver material on cylinder. Yes. See guys. I apply all materials. Now I create also camera animation. So camera check. Yes, guys, that's my camera. So select this camera and press this animation key. Now I go to like, guys, go to like 250. Camera angle like this. And check. And last one, go to back. Yes, that's my simple. And check. Right. Okay. So guys play actually select go on here and closer. Yes. And play. Yeah. See guys, that's my camera movement animation. Okay. So guys, now I create smoothness. So use subdivision surface, select this cloner and mix child with subdivision surface and play yes see guys now my spare is smooth okay so guys animation is good i create catchy so go to here guys that's my soft body and catchy clean object catchy check and press after that big object and create 100 percent Yes, guys, bake object is finished. Now go to camera and play. Yeah, better. See guys, that's my final animation. Okay, so guys, now frame full 600. Go to back and play. See guys, I really like this animation. Okay, so guys, yeah, again, create full frame and bake object check and guys go to render setting, guys, MB occlusion, maximum champ, I take 256, accuracy, I take 100% and take global illumination, guys, this time, indirectly catch, I take low and anti, select geometry, this one, only geometry for fast render and save, take JPEG sequences. And go to desktop, create new folder, take any folder name like this and output use all frame, right? That's my simple render setting. So close and again, one more time, guys, bake object check and create render. Yes. Okay. So guys, that's it. It's my final animation is finished. So if you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.